guys are being controlled by AI. Yeah, that's right. You guys are being controlled by all the AIs in the world. By the way, One World Trade Center, corporations are AI. Corporations are artificial intelligence. And I know I sound like a crazy lunatic with a beard. I'm just really fucking cold. <laughs> no, I'm out here in New York, enjoying my favorite area of the city, right by the Hudson River. It's the only place where you can get a little nature other than Central Park, which is uh, pretty nice too. I like that. But Hudson River seems to be my go-to. It's great for running, as you guys always see. But I wanted to talk about the real AI in the world. People don't really talk about this. Corporations are entities in the US and the world. They are their own entities with their own needs, wants, desires, their own laws. They're considered people. They have the rights of people. Why is this significant? Who the fuck cares, right? A corporation is a, an artificial intelligence with, you know, who the fuck cares? Well, the thing you've got to understand, if there were people walking around that were built solely to take advantage of everybody around them, if there were people walking around that were super powerful, sociopathic creatures that were designed to suck the money, the livelihood, and the time out of everyone around as fast as they can and propagate themselves everywhere, that would be pretty fucking crazy, right? That would be pretty fucking nuts. And we'd probably want to get rid of those people, right? And there are people like that. Hitler, Osama, Bin Laden, all these crazy motherfuckers. Kim Jong like Il or Un or whatever this name is now. We try to get rid of those people because they're nuts and they're killing people and they're starving them and whatever. Well, here's the thing. Corporations, I'm pointing because we're in New York. I hate New York, by the way. New York's a cool city. I'm like a nature guy, right? I like being out in nature. I like money. The point is you need to understand that corporations are not your friends. These are sociopathic creatures designed to control you without letting you know you're being controlled. The best way to control people is never let them know they're being controlled. Big Daddy John here, not big, telling you, you are being controlled. <laughs> if you are earning an hourly wage or a monthly salary, you're in the system, man. There's no way for you to get ahead. You've got to take your life into your own hands. Corporations are thinking, they're living beings. And when you're interacting with a corporation, when you're being hired by a company, whatever you're doing, you can't just think of the person that, your boss, the management or the executive or whatever. You've got to think about the corporation you're dealing with itself. What is the corporation going to want? If you have an arrangement with the company, I don't know what, some of you are really successful consultants or whatever you're doing. But when you've got an arrangement with the company, maybe you really like the executive you're working with or your boss or whatever. You've got to think about the company as a like an entity you are dealing with with its own mind and desire and it's a sociopathic creature that has no respect for humans. The reason why I rack so much on corporations is because I think people are meant for more than what we are. It's so hard to get ahead in today's world. If you are not working for yourself, I have so many friends who have gone down the path. They're working for companies. They're going nowhere in life. Everybody's stagnant. They are all, I don't know, working insurance or real estate or law or whatever. And they're not making very much money. They're not getting ahead. They're not building a future. They don't have a house. They don't have a family. All my friends are like 30 years old. These aren't the people I hang out with. But all my old friends, nothing's happening in their life. And I feel like there's so many people out there. How many people know what I'm talking about, by the way? Or you're continually trying, you're working, you're doing a good job, you're doing this, you're going about things with the right intention. You went to school, you went to college, you're building skills, and it's going nowhere. It sucks. That's the way the world works. It's being taken over by these AIs, artificial intelligence, is it's already here. Think. It's here. So everybody just thinks it's gonna be some like walking around robot that shoots people or it's gonna be some computer program that takes over and is talking to you. It's already happening. But guys, think to yourself, think about who you're dealing with, get out of the system, and let me know what your guys' thoughts are. Because 
this is a big topic of discussion. I know everybody's talking about Bitcoin and whatnot. And yes, that is a good way. Investing and stuff like that. That is a good way to get out of the system. Great way to get out of the system. Lots of good ways to get out of the system. That's one method. But the point is, I'm trying to get people to make that first step and quit their job. Everybody's chasing these little shiny objects and investing money, but they're not quitting their job. You know, they're taking their life savings and they're throwing it into random business opportunities. But they can't make the first step, which is transitioning out of their job and getting into something that's real, that makes some money. So guys, I'm off. I'm gonna find a peach. I'm freezing and uh, there's gotta be pizza around here. So I'll see guys like, subscribe, comment. I'll see you guys in the next video coming to you from the uh, smelly cold city of New York. See you guys next video, see ya. It's been amazing my life because John's program has actually helped me make an additional $2 million that changed my life. I'm freaking excited today. Uh, if you guys can tell, I got my first sale. Oh, he's like, I got two of them. Hi, John. I wanted to take a quick moment to give you a quick testimonial. Uh, yesterday, I made my first online affiliate commission. I'm absolutely, uh, totally excited. And for the first time, I really see that, you know, I have a future in this and I have someone who has my back. So again, John, just thank you so much for your time to just uh, help everybody in the group and just to give us, you know, nothing but, but value week after week after week. Again, thank you so much.